Good morning, you guys. How are you? Yes. It is time to go to school. And right before, um, I always check Tiana's book bag the morning before school, even though I should check it like the night after, but I already know kind of like what her home stuff she has to do at night. So I always like clean her book bag out in the morning before we go to school. So this morning, yeah, do your homework. Um, so this morning I decided I'm gonna clean the book bag out like normal. And I see a letter to the parents saying that they have a student that has L-I-C-E. And I'm like, now, to all my friends, who are you guys, you know that I'm black. And to all my white girlfriends, or my black girlfriend, like what do I do? Like I, I looked through her hair this morning, but her hair was already done, so it was too late, and I didn't notice anything. But um, one thing they said in the letter is that lice is not a sign of um, dirt, clean, dirty hair is a sign of clean hair, and lice like clean hair. So I'm just kinda assuming that they don't want me and Tiana dirty hair, cause our hair is dirty. Um, it's not dirty, but you know what I mean? It's oily, it has buildup, we use gels and creams and conditioners and this and that. But I was definitely shocked when I saw that so to all my friends, if I haven't figured it out by the time you guys see this video, to all my friends, especially you guys who have experience with lice, um, what do I do? Do I like call the pediatrician? Do I just keep looking in her head? What do I do? So Taylor is straight snoring in the back. But anyways, I just called Tiana's um, pediatrician and just asked her can I just bring her in to let her get checked and that is really just a precaution because I really don't know what I'm looking for I don't have that much experience with lice and I want to be sure before I take her into the nursery or soccer practice or whatever to make sure that that's not going to be an issue and we're not going to infect anybody else so hopefully they'll call me back in a few hours and maybe I could take her after school today just to get them to do a full check of her hair I have I'm, I'm not pleased I am not pleased so I'm here at uh -huh, I'm here at Burlington coat factory looking for shoes for Taylor and she insists on throwing them out the cart because she just wants me to hold her that's why so anyway you see anything you like Taylor Her feet are like fat but small, it's weird. Like they're like chubby little feet, but she only wears like a five, but she's a six because they're so fat. I know all the words, I've heard them in many voices. I feel them within your eyes, I'm judging but disappointed. You like these, Taylor? They're really sparkly. In good room. You like that? Do you like those? I literally committed like motherhood suicide today. I actually got the Moana soundtrack for Tiana. So, although she's really gonna love me, I'm gonna hate myself in probably about two days. But I got the Moana soundtrack, so I'm going to play in the car, and I'm going to Tiana get in the car. And when she hears those songs, I know her heart is literally going to stop. I did want to do like a really quick haul for you guys just to see if you guys could see what I got before I went to go pick Tiana up. So I just picked me up these um, earrings from the Blessed Collection. And they're just like um, like fake little diamonds set in like rose gold. And that's because I don't know if you guys have noticed I haven't been wearing earrings much lately. And that's because I don't have any. Um... And I also picked up something that I have been on the fence about because Devin literally hates these, but I really like them and they're really on trend. But I just picked me up this five, this five um, pack of chokers. Um, and I thought these ones were really subtle. They're not too gaudy. I probably will just stick with something kind of light like that gold one to start out. But hopefully he won't notice. But by this, he watches all the vlogs, so he'll notice. But um he doesn't like chokers he said they look like collars and he just thinks they're weird but i think they're so cute so i'm just gonna you know just try and throw that in there and 
And I just got the shoes that I showed you guys for Taylor and here's one pair of them. They're just a rose gold like glitter print shoe. So I thought those were really cute. And then I also got her these little shoes um, and they are US Polo Assassin like the off-brand polo, but I just thought they were like really cute casual shoes and it's not like that logo or symbol is on it like anywhere like significant. So I don't think it'll be that big of an issue and she's one and I could really care less. But yeah, so I got those for her just so she could have two pairs of sneakers and two pairs of sandals. Um, just trying to get that out the way because her feet is grow are her feet are growing faster than Tiana's. Like of course, because Tiana's older now, she stays in the same size shoe longer. Taylor is in like a five and a half to a six now, so all of her shoes she has on currently do don't fit anymore. So yeah, that's why I had to get new shoes. Duh, Quita. Hi guys. Good afternoon, friends. I'm a little shiny, but anyways, it is afternoon, and um, I can't even remember the last clip that I vlogged, and it was pretty. I'm pretty sure it was after Tiana got out of school, and I was probably vlogging me picking her up. But let me tell you guys. The Moana CD was a hit. She absolutely loved it. Um, so now I'm getting ready to cook dinner and wash these dishes. Cause I am literally so sad, but I'm out of dishwashing packs. So I will be doing the good old fashioned way. I will be hand washing. Um, so I'm gonna get ready to make dinner. And um, I have to cook the dinner. She comes running and says, I want some dinner, I want some dinner. Okay, you guys, I'm about to get this young gym workout in. I haven't been to the gym in about 10 days, so let's get it done. Intimidating than when you haven't been to the gym in a while. So awkward. 